Wide July 4th event. Security may be top of mind, but safety at our local parks has been ongoing. It's a conversation they've had for months now. Now Atlanta City Council says it is considering adding park rangers. CBS 46 is Sierra Cummings joins us live tonight with these brand new efforts. Good evening. The vote is set for this upcoming Tuesday. The idea is to figure out how much and how long it would take to create a park ranger agency. Now it comes nearly a year after some of the city's most gruesome crimes across Atlanta parks. We want to make sure that our citizens, our visitors who use our parks are in a safe space and know that, you know, when they leave, leave their car in the parking lot to go swim or to use the park facilities, that is going to be safe when they return and that they'll be safe. Nearly one year after the murder of Katie Janess in Piedmont Park and a rash of crimes at others, Atlanta City Council is looking to a feasibility study examining cost and resources required for park rangers across the most populated sites. Permanently assigned to park locations can't be pulled away because of a 911 call like what happens with APD currently. For the past few months, we've been installing our cameras. APD has ramped up patrols and upgraded surveillance, a move unsettled residents were eager to see. It really changed my behaviors on when I'm walking, where I'm walking. Well, security systems are still being added across Atlanta's 200 city parks. Councilman Julian Bond is endorsing full time law enforcement here, but he says it's no quick decision as agencies across the state and nation face officer shortages. It it is regrettable that we have to pursue this effort, but we the circumstances dictate that we obviously need more security in our parks and in our city. And should the resolution pass this Tuesday, nothing would immediately change. The city would be in planning stages for months and then later trying to figure out how to hire Georgia Post certified law enforcement officers in this very competitive industry right now. We're live in Atlanta. I'm Sierra Cummings, CBS 46 News. Sierra, thank you.